Welcome and thank you for tuning in for this special Take 10 presentation. I'm Laurence gasset lucasic Director for Expedition Cruising at Abercrombie & Kent, and I am thrilled to present our Adriatic voyage, Croatia, Montenegro, and Greece. I'm particularly excited about this itinerary as it bridges two best-selling journeys to make one 28-day Grand Mediterranean voyage, featuring almost the entire navigable coast of Italy, gems of the Adriatic, Emerald Islands of Western Greece, the historic transits through the Corinth Canal and the best Greek Isles. This program begins in fabled Venice. Then our small ship is able to get close access to Split and Dubrovnik in Croatia, also Montenegro's Kotor. We then reach the Emerald Islands of Western Greece, Corfu and Kefalonia, followed by Itea and Delphi, and culminating with the transits through the Corinth Canal to end in Athens. As for any of our cultural luxury expedition cruises, you will have up to five excursions to choose from at each port call. All excursions are included in your journey, some focused on culture and history, some active experiences, some culinary adventures, all are included. And each excursion is always in a small group led by an expert local guide and assisted by a tour manager, so the guide can focus on guiding. You are also provided with a listening device so you can roam freely and still hear your guide. Guests who have traveled with us in the past know the importance of our extensive expedition team. We bring our very own team of professionals on each voyage. They handle every detail of the journey so you can relax and enjoy. This eight day voyage highlights the best of Croatia, Montenegro and Western Greece. By having a choice of included shore excursions options, you can customize your experience at each stop. So it can be a culinary experience one day, a nature hike or kayaking the next, or a cultural excursion after that. You pick the excursions and pace that best suit your interest and fitness level. Let's start by pointing out the impressive collection of UNESCO World Heritage Sites featured on this program. When calling in Split, you may opt for our Treasures of Croatia excursion featuring visits to Split and Trogir, both UNESCO sites, to see the massive fortress of Camerlango that you see here, for example. Then back in Split, you visit the incredible ruins of the Doclesian Palace, learning about life under Roman emperors. Other UNESCO sites include the natural, cultural, and historical region of Kotor in Montenegro, the old city of Dubrovnik in Croatia, in Greece, the old town of Corfu, and the incredible archaeological site of Delphi. Joining a small ship expedition cruise means you can get close to sites and reach smaller ports. In Montenegro, for example, you will get special access to Kotor. You may discover the medieval and architectural treasures of Kotor during a guided walk through the old town. You may enjoy an exciting boat ride to the picturesque Blue Cave followed by a beach break. Or you may opt for a boat tour in the Bay of Kotor, reaching the charming town of Perast. Several active options are offered during this journey such as an opportunity to see Dubrovnik from an unusual angle, getting close to the city walls by kayak. Kayaking is also offered in the Greek island of Kefalonia. You may also want to visit the Emerald Island of Corfu, joining a mountain bike tour. On any full day excursion, a lunch of local specialties is always included. You also have dedicated culinary experiences to choose from throughout the program such as a Mediterranean food and olive oil experience in Split, a taste of Croatia tour in Dubrovnik, tasting delicacies of the Dalmatian coast, a hands-on cooking experience in Corfu, or even a beekeeping experience in Delphi, complete with honey tasting. And concluding your journey with a wow, it, I must mention the bucket list adventure that is the transit through the narrow Corinth Canal. Only small expedition cruisers like yours can enter and provide you with a thrilling and up close experience through the four mile long canal before concluding the voyage in Athens. All of these gorgeous locales and unforgettable experiences are reached by ship. For this journey, we charter the Le Bougainville, which look absolutely stunning moored along alongside the lovely islands we visit. 
The vessel could accommodate 184 passengers. However, at ANK, we limit the occupancy to 148 guests. Once you account for solo travelers and the space needed for our expedition team, there will actually be around 120 to 130 guests on this voyage. That's about 70% of the designed occupancy. On an ANK luxury expedition cruise, we mean and deliver an all-inclusive experience with all transfers, excursions, special events on board and on shore, meals and drinks, our Traveler's Valley laundry service, Wi-Fi, gratuities, all are included. And we really mean all gratuities to the crew, drivers, guides, porters, and wait staff. Guests in suite categories also receive butler service on board. The culinary experience on board features French and international cuisine and includes early riser coffee and pastries, breakfast, complimentary 24-hour room service, lunch, afternoon tea, dinner, and evening snacks. A program of engaging and educational presentations by experts is also offered, making your onshore experience all the more interesting and meaningful. The language spoken on board is always and only English. All announcements and lectures are done only in English. And remember, there are no optional excursions, no hidden charges or taxes, no extras on an ANK luxury expedition cruising. You may also want to complete your Adriatic and Western Greece experience with a pre or a post tour extension. You can start in Rome, enjoying a three night stay in a centrally located hotel, strolling through the narrow streets and beautiful piazzas, enjoying delicious Roman specialties before heading to Venice to begin the main program. And end in Northern Greece for three nights in Thessaloniki, visiting the picturesque and historic monasteries of Meteora, the sites of Pella and Virgina, while also delighting in Northern Greece culinary specialties. This voyage can be combined with two other expeditions. You may start with our Italy cruise featuring three days in Tuscany, Corsica, Rome, Sardinia, Sicily, Bari in Apulia, the Marquis region, and ending in Venice. Then remain on board for your expedition from Venice to Athens, featuring Croatia, Montenegro, the Emerald Islands of Corfu and Kefalonia that we just talked about. And finally, you end with cruising the Greek Isles. So a total of 28 exciting days in some of the world's most beautiful regions. We look forward to welcoming all of our travelers and in particular, don't miss this opportunity to join our team for ANK's Adriatic Cruise. Please visit our website to take a look at our luxury expedition cruise portfolio this year. To reserve your place on this or any of our luxury expedition cruises, please call ANK or contact your travel advisor. Thank you for tuning in.